Hey guys and welcome back to this channel. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how you can edit images on CapCut and export it as like a JPEG, like an image file. So instead of selecting new project, go to photo editor, which is on your homepage. Select an image and select edit. And here's where you can basically edit your image. You can add in text. I'm just going to type in I'm just going to select like a text template here. Well, I like this one. And I'm just going to type in uh, Taylor. Can I change the colors here? Let's see. Style. Oh, I can. Um, just go to style and you can select any color you want. Then you can add in shapes as well. You can add in stickers. Oh, I don't have internet connection, so I'm not going to do that. You can add another photo. Um, also, before you... Okay, actually, you can still move it. I'm just going to move it down here. And you can also adjust your photos here. You can add in filters as well. Um, I like this one. Wait, I like this one then. You can add in a background as well, but you'll have to like remove it. Or you can, I guess, like make it smaller and then go to background and add in like a color or like an image. I'm trying to find like the same color. You can use the color picker here of course um you can like select the picture here and you can like remove the background by using cutout but i'm not going to do that and once you're done editing can i use stickers now okay i guess the internet is still like not okay but there are a few that i can use here See, these ones are, these frame ones are pretty cute actually. How about these ones? Um, let's like add in maybe this flower and you can like resize it and just move it around I guess. Like so. Um, and once you're done. You're just going to select export and it's going to be saved as an image. And that is it. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, share. Also subscribe to this channel if you haven't done that already. If you have any questions, just leave it in the comment section down below and I'll try my best to answer them all for you guys. And if you found this video helpful, please click the thanks button above the description box down below. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!